What was Vince Gironda's diet like? Okay, th this is actually uh, in response to a comment that somebody made on one of my videos. Okay, people were asking me all the time about Vince Gironda's steak and eggs diet. Can I have this? Can I have that? One of the common questions was, can I uh, have protein shakes on this diet? The answer is no, okay? And, uh, but somebody made a comment on that video, okay, that I just saw, and he said, Vince Gironda himself said you could have uh, protein shakes on the steak and eggs diet. Okay, it kind of reminds me of a comment that um, I apologize. I know I'm not as good at using Facebook as I should be, so I apologize to anybody who's wondering why I'm never there. But, you know, somebody made a comment a while ago when I was trying to figure out Facebook on my Facebook page. It was the same thing. It was uh, the guy asked me about cheese. I said, yeah, no problem. And then he said, uh, you know, Vince Gironda said you can't eat cheese. And I'm like, really, what are you basing that on? He's, and he sent me a, a screenshot of a book written by Vince Gironda you know, uh, that showed his steak and eggs diet, okay? And, um, you know, there was no, and it said specifically, you know, you can't eat any cheese on it, okay? Now, this is the deal, okay? Vince Gironda was a nutritionist, okay? People went to him and they're like, listen, I have this kind of an issue. Yeah, he did training too. He owned a gym also. He did a lot of things, but he his really big deal that I'm very interested in is his nutrition, okay? So when you went to him, you said, hey, I'm in this situation and this is my goal. And he would give you the best diet possible for a person in your situation to reach your personal goal. Okay, that doesn't mean he only had one diet and that doesn't mean that he only gave out one set of diet advice, okay? For instance, okay, um, you know, uh, the steak and eggs diet, which later became known as the meat, eggs, and water diet, the um, maximum definition diet, it's probably Vince Gironda's most famous, most well-known diet and a lot of people base everything on that, okay? That's why, this one guy in Facebook was like, well, he, you know, he said you can't eat cheese. Well, that's you know, a diet to lose weight, maybe to recompose your body. The thing is, there are also diets that are like lean bulking diets, okay? Uh, Vince Gironda also had like uh, the hormone precursor diet, okay? Where, you know, carbohydrates, he actually had you putting a banana and a bunch of eggs together, okay, mixed with some half and half, okay, in a blender and drinking that like, you know, two to three times a day. That's like, you know, one, two, three dozen eggs a day mixed with half and half and a banana, okay, and like a couple pieces of meat, okay. So obviously on that diet, yes, you were allowed to have, uh, you know, protein shakes. So what I'm basically trying to say is, you know, there are like a million different diets out there. You know, the steak and eggs diet, you just ate, you know, beef steak, not even chopped meat, beef steak and uh, whole eggs fried in butter twice a day. Then later on, you know, he had you having a salad with that, okay, for some fiber. Then it went from the steak and eggs diet to the meat, eggs, and water diet. You could have any type of meat, fish, chicken, you know, pork, any kind of meat you wanted, as long as it was meat, eggs, and water that you had two or three times a day. Then it got called the maximum definition diet. You know, you learn and you as you grow, okay? Um, you know, and like I said, I mean, you know, well, you have to have, you know, steak and eggs. No, you don't. I mean, he had a, a pure vegetarian diet. Vince Gironda, believe it or not, had a, like a vegetarian, vegan cleansing diet. You know, he even said himself, like, when you lose taste, when you can't, you know, stomach meat anymore, he said, you know, you're just getting just too much protein, too much meat. You just need to go ahead and spend a few weeks or a few days, you know, eating, you know, just a bunch of greens, basically, it cleanses your body, you know, it kind of like restarts you, it's almost like a cleanse, a fast, whatever you would call it these days, you know, and then you go back to whatever kind of diet, you know, like I said, he had, you know, diets where you would be, uh, you know, cheese, okay, on the steak and eggs diet, you don't eat cheese, that's very true, that one guy who said that, it's very true, but on, uh, I think it was the all muscle, uh, all protein muscle building diet. You had like, you know, three eggs with half and half and protein powder for breakfast. Uh, then you had a snack of cheese, natural cheese. Okay. Then you had like some meat, then you had some meat, and then you had another protein shake before you went to bed. You know, so like I said, what I'm basically saying is, you know, when you look at somebody, it's like, well, what's your diet? You know, the diet for anybody, whether they're an athlete or a bodybuilder or a model or just a healthy person or a nutritionist or whatever, you know, uh, depending upon whether you're trying to gain muscle, gain mass, you know, whether you're trying to uh, lose fat, lose weight, 
whether you're trying to uh, improve your ability to run, your strength, your, you know, whatever it is. I mean, there are a million different reasons to go on a certain diet, you know, and there are a million, you know, which means there are a million diets out there for each person who writes diets. You know, even with me, people are like, well, why aren't you on the steak and eggs diet? So like, well, I'm on the pure protein diet. You know, then people got to used to that, you know, like, okay, sometimes I'm on the steak and eggs diet. Sometimes I'm on the pure protein diet. But why aren't you on the pure protein diet? Because right now I'm on the anaerobics diet. You know, it's like, you know, the bottom line is you need to find out where you are right now, okay, where you want to be and what version of which diet is best to take you from where you are right now to where you want to be.